So you wanna go live on TikTok through your computer, but you're not quite sure how. There's actually a really easy way to do this. I'm gonna show you two different ways of doing this. However, you need to know that most people are not given access to this ability. So TikTok actually has to manually give you your stream key access. It's information for the server and your stream key so that you can use a third party like Restream or BeLive, which I'm gonna show you, to then live stream with customized branding and screen sharing and all those good things. But most people don't have access to this. Now, as a professional live streamer who educates on this and works with the biggest companies in the industry, including TikTok, I don't have access to it, which means you probably don't either. However, you can save this video and come back to it or watch it now to learn how to do this because you can actually use these tools and resources for all the other live streaming as well. So when it comes to this, if you have your stream key, you're going to go over to your TikTok on your phone and set up a live stream as if you were going live through your phone. On the bottom, they would give you access to your server name and to your stream key so that you could then put it into a third party and go live from there. If you do not see it, if it's not clearly ab abundantly clear to you, if it's not very much there, it means you don't have it. It's not hidden. It's not somewhere removed. It just means you do not have access. Like I don't have access. Now in the future, I'm sure they're going to be rolling out more of this so that other people have access as well, which means you could in the future have access to this, but right this very second, you might not. If you do have access to this, congratulations. Let me know your secret. Let's take a look at BeLive and Restream so that we can know exactly how you can be using this properly to live stream on TikTok. Now inside of your BeLive dashboard, you're just going to go to Edit Destination and at that point you're going to click the little plus button and you're going to scroll down to Custom RTMP. Now once you're there, all you have to do is type in the server URL, so they're going to give that to you inside of TikTok, type that in there and then type in your stream key. So the server means it's going to send it over to TikTok, the stream key is going to send it to your individual channel. You have to have both of those pieces or you cannot do this. Once you have typed both of those things in, you're just going to save it and you will be good to go for there. It's really easy to do that and then of course you can do your overlays and you can do moving things on your screen, you can have multiple guests on, you can do custom branding, you can screen share, overlays, backgrounds, videos, pre-recorded videos, all of the things that you can normally do inside of BeLive. And I've got lots of video tutorials on how to do that down below if that's something that you're looking for. If you don't want to use BeLive, you can then jump over to Restream. Now inside of Restream, you are going to be doing very, very similar things. And keep in mind, I do have access to both BeLive and to Restream linked for you down below, free trials and discounts. You're welcome. So all you're going to do inside of Restream is go up to the top where it says your title for your show and you're just going to type in your title name, the description, which isn't going to go anywhere on TikTok and you can set what type of content it is. Now this is more designed for the YouTube side of things, but you get the picture. You can then click that next button and at this point you have all of your destinations. So you're just going to toggle on and off what you do and do not want and if it's not there and ready for you, you can just click add destination at which point you are just going to be able to put in that custom RTMP and again, we're just going to put in your URL for the server and the stream key and then you're just going to add in that channel and you will be good to go on Restream. And again, this does allow you to do some really cool things like the customized branding. It's going to allow you to do overlays and have guests on and screen share and you can even do things like add in background music via Restream which is licensed to you. It is royalty free if you are using the Restream system and you can have background music inside of your live streams on TikTok, which we've actually talked about how you can't be playing music on TikToks or Instagram live streams or even YouTube live streams if it's not properly licensed. I'll link that video down below for you. This is some music that you can actually legally use without getting into trouble or getting sued, which is something we're trying to avoid. So if you have access to the server and the stream key, you can then live stream via your computer to TikTok, to Instagram, or to any of the other platforms if they've given you that stream key, which makes it really, really easy to do all of the really customized things that you want for your live streams. And keep in mind, we are looking at a different type of system for this, so whereas you might be streaming horizontally on normal platforms like YouTube or Facebook, you will have to be streaming vertically. So keep in mind where that camera is going to be and think that through before you live stream on a vertical platform like Instagram or like TikTok. 
Now, if you've got questions on this, let me know down below. And if you've got a contact at TikTok, it's better than my contact at TikTok, please let me know because then we'll get all these train keys for all of us and have amazing times over on the TikTok live stream platform. And if you have more questions on TikTok, on Instagram, on YouTube, on live streaming, or on technology that's going to help you to level up what you're doing inside of your marketing online, let me know down below and hit that subscribe and notification bell because I'm dropping new videos every single day to help you level up and pivot as the social platforms are changing and adding platform additions so that you are ahead of the game and ahead of the competition to make sure that you know exactly what you're doing on social, to create community and conversation, and save you a ton of time and stress. Drop all your questions on all the social platforms down below, and I'll see you in the next video.